hands-on with the Akidio Thunder 3 Quad X, direct attached Thunderbolt 3 storage for your Mac. When it comes to Thunderbolt 3 peripherals, there are a handful of companies that come to mind. Akidio, a California-based innovator, is definitely one of those companies. One of its first big Thunderbolt 3 equipped products, the Akidio Node, made headlines for its inclusion of a macOS compatible Thunderbolt 3 chipset. Its latest release, the Thunder 3 Quad X, is a direct access storage enclosure that pays homage to classic Mac Pro design. Like the Quad Mini before it, the Quad X supports up to four drives and can harness software RAID to achieve impressive data transfer rates. The biggest differentiator between the Quad Mini and the Quad X is that the latter can support larger 3.5 inch drives as well which makes it possible to use up to four mechanical spinning hard drives inside. The Thunder 3 Quad Mini also delivers more power, up to 27 watts to a compatible MacBook Pro than the smaller Quad Mini. That's still not enough juice to charge a 13 or 15 inch MacBook Pro at full speed, but 27 watts is usually enough to maintain and or slowly charge your laptop. There's also the design, which is more interesting than any drive enclosure or external GPU that Akidio has ever shipped. Those who love the classic Mac Pro design, the cheese grater design, will likely enjoy the look of the Quad X. The all aluminum unit is somewhat heavy and it does take up a larger footprint than the Quad Mini, but it's also able to accommodate larger drives. Like other Akidio products, there is a display port connection on the rear of the Quad X. This lets users easily connect to an external display up to 4K at 60 Hz, making for a potent video editing setup. If you want to get the most out of the Quad X, you're going to need to use software RAID. A RAID 0 setup with four 1TB SSDs like I have yields speeds that are more than enough to accommodate 4K workflows at high frame rates, and that also provides a fair amount of storage space. Now granted, there are some inherent downsides to using RAID 0, such as an increased risk of drive failure, so make sure you have backups. One last thing that I'd like to comment on is the fan switch that Akidio includes on the rear of the Quad X. This switch allows you to disable the exhaust fan outright, which provides dead silent operation if using SSDs. Though Akidio notes that the fan should not be disabled for more than 30 minutes at a time. My main beef with this whole setup is that if Akidio simply opted for higher quality fan components, then it would probably be quiet enough to keep the fan running. The design of the device and the desktop footprint certainly won't be for everyone, but for those who want the flexibility that a larger enclosure offers, and or for those who have a particular fondness for the cheese grater Mac Pro, the Akidio Thunder 3 Quad X may prove to be a solid addition to your setup. Share your thoughts down below in the comments. This is Jeff with 9to5Mac.